Hey guys, it's me, Game Change RV, and today we'll be exploring the new SBCs in FIFA 22. So, guys, today we've got the Dynamic Duos SBC that's out. It's one of a kind, actually, the first we've seen. Complete these challenges to earn OMs with Marseille's Dynamic Duos, Mbemba, and Suarez, and a bonus group reward pack, which is a tradable. Well, I'm not sure if it's tradable, but it's a 7.5k pack. So, let's have a look at this Mbemba first. He's a centre back. Um, we'll look at the requirements before we look at his card. He's, you have to have 11 league gun players in the starting 11. 86 and a higher rated players 1. And 85 and rated higher players 1. And 84 chemistry. No, 84 team rating. So 84 rating, an 85 rated player and an 86 rated player in the squad. And a league gun player. I'm glad there's no more chemistry this year. They just made SBCs way too hard. So let's have a look at this new card then. From the league gun as a centre back. They are usually very popular positions, so hopefully it's going to be something that will be quite usable for a long time, I suppose. Because it's all about longevity at this stage of FIFA. So, he's two stars, three stars. Medium high work rates is definitely what you want to see. You don't want your centre-back running up the pitch. You want him to stay back, stay put. 78 pace, that's okay for this stage of the game. And maybe even a little further for about a month, I'd say. A month is probably max. 86 standing tackle is very nice. The defending and physical column are great. He looks like a very strong centre back. Any traits, dives into tackle, long pass. He's got the giant throw in one that you can actually use, but the other one's a CPU. And Luis Javier Suarez, three star, four star, high medium. I mean, the skills are a bit of a letdown, but they don't matter as much as they have done previously. High medium work rates is quite good. The pace is fantastic. 87 pace on a striker is great. And now they also get a strong link because they link across the pitch, you know. They get that one star. 83 shooting is really, really good, actually. For a card at this stage of the game, 83 shooting is nice. Because there's not many cards that have as good shooting as that around nowadays. 85 finishing is really, really nice. Composure is a bit on the low side, but I don't think that will matter that much at this stage. Physical is quite good as well. 86 aggression, 85 strength. 83 agility, 81 balance. That's not a bad card either. So now let's have a look at his requirements. 84 rated squad and an only an 85 rated player. You don't need an 86 one like you do in Mbemba's one. And one league and player in your starting squad. That's not bad. That's quite reasonable, I suppose, for this dynamic duo. But I love the concept from EA Sports. It's a really nice concept that they've added and I just can't wait to see more. Now, is there anything else that we've got in store today? Okay, we've got a 78 plus upgrade, which is repeatable. Um, let's see how reasonably priced this is. Six gold players. This is, I think that's the same as the, what was it called before? Newcomer challenge or something? No, this early access upgrade pack. To get a 78 plus rated rare player, then it was quite useful because there were not many people, no one was on the game and you could just get them from the companion app, but... Here, I don't think that's going to be as good as it was before. That's the newcomer's challenge with the 75 plus rated rare player. And yeah, this is also untradeable. So that is the new content there for today, guys. If you liked it, then make sure you smash a like on the video. Make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss a video on my channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.